Yo, that ain't bad, Grillo. All right, it's my third 81 hour fast. Technically, I'm about eight or nine hours in right now, but I still feel really stuffed from last night. But let's go get our weight, get some coffee, get some salt water, and get this started. All right, we are at Whole Foods, about to go in and get some food for the week. We just got back from Whole Foods and I'm gonna show you a little bit of what we got. Rotisserie chicken. Brenna usually gets a container of this coconut. She really loves that they cut it up and put it into these containers for you, nice and easy. We love to get this Lacinto kale or dino kale and we make a really good salad with it. If we do end up making it, I will take a video of it and put it on this vlog. Whole Foods brand, jalapeno hummus. I'm looking forward to having this on Wednesday on my eating day. King Arthur flour. We love this California olive oil. Lastly, we saw this and we wanted to give it a try. Grillo's fresh lemon vinegar drink. It says electrolytes real big on it here. It has 25 calories on it. Normally I drink, uh, like a black coffee is about five calories. So maybe I'll have a couple of sips of this. Brenna wanted to try it. She's having some heartburn problems with her pregnancy. Am I allowed to say that? Okay, Am I allowed to say you're having pregnancy <laughs> heartburn? <That's fine. laughs> She's having some uh, heartburn with her pregnancy. So it says right on here, why vinegar, it's a vinegar drink it says why vinegar vinegar can help with acid reflux and digestion i'm about to try this grillo's cold pressed lemon vinegar drink yo that ain't bad grillo that ain't bad grillo i'm not gonna drink the whole thing like i said it has 25 calories in it I don't want all those calories. I'm gonna have a couple sips now and then give the rest to Brenna. I think she's really gonna like it too. Gorilla dog, you doing it big. It's good, seriously. It's uh, like, it's not too pickly. It's like a, kind of like a pickle thing, but it's not too pickly, this lemon flavor. Yo. So I wouldn't drink all of that in one sitting, but while I'm fasting, but if you're not fasting, that would be great for workout. I totally believe in that. I totally believe in the idea of pickle juice for getting your electrolytes and cramping. It seems like it's a, it's a pretty good thing. Maybe you could have a little bit in the morning, a little bit in the afternoon, a little bit in the evening. Um, so yeah, it seems like a pretty good product to me. All right, it's morning of day two of the fast and I just dropped Brenna off at the hospital. She has a, just a checkup. I'm not supposed to go in uh, because of the coronavirus stuff. So I'm gonna go get an Americano at Starbucks and sit in my car and wait for her. Now, while she's in there, I'm gonna sit in my car and read The Omnivore's Dilemma by Michael Pollan. It's a really great book about where our food comes from, which is something that greatly interests me. Maybe when I'm done reading this, I'll let everybody know what I learned from it, but so far I'm, I'm like maybe a quarter of the way through it so far. I really love it.
All right, so it's about noon on day three of my fast, and I've been neglecting some yard work for a long time. I spent a lot of time this spring doing a lot of yard work and getting our front yard landscaped. And then just since I did all of that, I've kind of let it, the weeds get overgrown. So I'm gonna take some time today and weed my front garden. And I'll show you guys, it looks really bad. All right, let's make that kale asparagus salad. First you wanna roast your asparagus. Then you wanna cut your white cheddar into small bite-sized pieces. Rinse your kale, then remove it from the stem and chop. Toast the slivered almonds, but make sure you don't toast them for too long or they will burn. Combine all the ingredients and toss with two tablespoons of olive oil, one tablespoon of lemon juice, salt, and some freshly cracked pepper. We like to serve this as a side with grilled chicken. It's been 11 days since I started the 28 day challenge and I've worked out every day or done something. Two of the days, I, one of the days I just did a walk, but I've done something every day. And I think 11 days is uh, enough in a row. So I'm not gonna row today. Uh, I was also, I was outside doing yard work all day, so I think if there is a day that I should take off, it would be today because I was active anyway, which is important. Everybody just needs to be active every day. You don't necessarily need to put in like a hard workout. All right, it's the end of day three on my 81 hour fast, my third 81 hour fast. I'm uh, feeling good. I'm excited to wake up and eat some Pop-Tarts. I'll see you in the morning. All right, it is morning of the eating day. I made it again, no problem. I'm gonna weigh myself, get some coffee, and I'll see you in just a little bit for the mukbang. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you next time.